so now we're just trying to find Carolyn. She's already here. She's got a plug-in site. And we're just going to park next to her and boondock and just pay our $10 fee. <laughs> we're just going around in the big square. Before we go and get parked, we're just going to fill up on propane here, which is three fifty dollars per gallon. We're just following him out to the bluegrass site. It'll be near Carolyn, but she's hooked up. So he said he would just get us close to her on the boondocking sites. Look at the cute shih tzu. That's a big one. Aww. Hello. So here's where we are. I'll show you where we are compared to, ooh, I love it out here. Oh, nice. She got an end space so we can kind of have like a corner lot. Hi, Cinnamon. She got nice and cleaned up. Got a pretty bow in her hair. Got combed out. You look pretty. Look at you. It's so cold today. It's 57 degrees and it's pretty windy. We got such a beautiful spot here. 10 bucks a night for the weekend. We're gonna stay here a night or two. Hi everyone. We're here at the Bluegrass Festival in Arcadia, Florida. Look at our front yard. Isn't it amazing? So, so pretty today. It's like 70, maybe 70. It's so gorgeous here. It's not real packed yet, but I imagine it will get busy. And then there's like a golf course and a track over there, I think. Beautiful here. They have a concession stand and we haven't eaten breakfast or lunch, so we're going to go grab a bite to eat over here. They also have, I believe, showers and stuff. Here's where all the music is going to be performed. They're getting set up right now. I believe this goes through Sunday. Today's Saturday. I didn't hear much going on last night, but they were supposed to start jamming last night. It was kind of, it was really cold actually. But this is called the Heartland Bluegrass Music Association of Florida. So that's who performs here at Craig's RV Park. And here's a concession. They make a nice little profit off of their charbroiled hamburgers and whatnot. So we're going to see all what they have. and. Yeah, here's the awesome festival here. Looks like a little cafe. Our concession is called the Dixie Kitchen. And there's the menu. Once we get a little closer, we'll be able to see what we want to eat. Looks like a hamburger is $3. Cheeseburger, $3.50. So the prices aren't bad. Hot dog, $3. And lots of other probably fried stuff. Look at this awesome outdoor kitchen. Isn't this wonderful? Working hard in there. <laughs> Hamburgers, french fries, and chili dogs.
cutie. Over here. Hi, honey. Hi. You made it. I'm so glad you could come to the banjo event. Yes, honey. <laughs> What are you doing? Filming me. Hahaha. <laughs> <laughs> Banjo's wanting to make a friend. You want to play, baby? He is wanting to make friends with that big golden doodle. He loves big puppies. Banjo, you want to show everyone what we fastened to the bike so you can ride with me? We're still testing it out, but I tried it the other day and it seemed to work. He just needs practice staying in there. So, um, yeah, I'll let y'all see how it, how it works. He likes to be in the front. There he is. So we're doing a little trial run with the puppy in the basket. We're going to try to ride on this track and see how smooth it is. I saw somebody riding their bike over here, so hopefully it's fine. Banjo all right? Okay. Check out this nice track. Hold still, Banjo. Hold still, honey. Oh, okay, bikes have to go the other way. Look at, they have a little memorial here. In the dog park. Great. This is called Max's Wiggly Field. That's really cute. Yeah. You want to play in the dog park? Oh, that's a really nice place. Very shaded and everything. Go for a little ride first. Babe. All right, that was fun. Now I'm going to ride, okay? You seem like you're a little nervous yet. We still need to do practice, and Mom wants to go ride a little bit.
Oh, there's a track out here. They're riding their bikes around it. It's a walking track. Cool. There goes Dana. To, she's trying to catch up with the kids and Carolyn and Danny. You can hear the music in the background. And they let people park their RVs right here. That's cool. Here they are. comes Dana. Zooming right along. There's Ethan right there. Looks like he's, yeah, he's on my bike. Catching up to the group. They're going all the way around. That is pretty cool. And that's where we're parked. I'm not sure if Dana's already showing this or not. Carolyn's over there behind us back that way. And Chuslin's bike has a flat and then I guess it's not working again. Here they come. Whee! Uh oh, Carolyn says she dropped her phone back there. I haven't seen it. And we're gonna go fix her tire. I, it's not flat, I just, the tire's kinda going off the edge. I didn't see this, I had it tipped over upside down. This was on the other side, I couldn't see it, so. I'm gonna fix that. Here they are, the bike biker gang. They're back. I'm going to take my bike for a spin around the track. Yep. Did you say how Ethan's is completely kaput? Oh, let me show. Yeah. I can't. I'm not sure if I've. Sh We've. Yeah, his um, handlebars are just totally split and broke. So we've got to get this whole new piece that fits in here with the handlebar attached. See where the. Uh, see where it just like cracked and eventually just broke off. <laughs> See you later. Bye. There is Carolyn, Mommy, Jocelyn, and Daddy, which Aubrey's somewhere. But anyways, that's Daddy's. Bye-bye.